redemption I forgot to mention that I have a strong urge a thirst for the world inside daydreams I can see past the caravans be caught inside an oyster shimmering glimmering made waves in the sky stick my tongue All we got left is Papa Dom's to eat. But no, we stayed in this hotel and it was absolutely gorgeous, it really was. The name of the hotel, I think it's called the White Horse. I can't remember, I'll update it later, or I'll put it on the screen. But this hotel. We had a massive room and it was only 60 quid. Now we're slightly off season, but look at the car park. Look at your views. I was going to put the drone up, but we've got to get off. So, so this is a massive thumbs up, especially if you're a biker. The food was brilliant. The staff, is in particular, the Scottish lady, I can't remember her name now, who ran around doing everything for us, basically. She was so good. Um, big thumbs up, 10 out of 10 for this place. Uh, value for money absolutely amazing um i hope they keep it as it is it's quiet it's very very quiet but as she said the, the lady that's running it um it will just switch like that and it'll just be flat out flat out also perfected a better way of uh, just leaving most of our stuff on the bikes and just taking off what we need to go into a hotel like a clothes and that the lizzie's idea Time to head off, let's go.
Dude, how are you doing? Oh, very good, how are you? <laughs> I've got my camera on, is that alright? I'd already put it on, and then she said, is that pretty? This is Danny. Oh, hello, Danny. Oh, let me get my leg on. Yeah. Oh, Alright, that's it. Nice to meet you, Danny. We're actually uh, Lincoln here at the moment. We've been up in. Uh, where did we go? We've been oh. up. We went up to Yorkshire, and then we went to Northumberland. Oh, that's where we we're going. Yeah, we did yeah, the Northumberland yeah. 250. Uh, okay, okay. How was it? Amazing. Yeah, was it absolutely yeah. beautiful? Yeah, yeah. Lovely. It's beautiful, and yeah. the the the, uh, <laughs> the east coast. Yeah. From uh, what's that castle? Bamberg Castle. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh wow. Absolutely How is amazing. Lovely. Is it really? really Beautiful, good. massive, you know, medieval castle, yeah. all the way down to. Oh, I can't remember where we went now. How many but, days have we been away? Uh, about seven or eight. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're only going back for yeah. your birthday, and then we're coming back up for the Yeah. Are you really? No way. Yeah. How many days in Scotland? We're homeless, aren't we? This is it. This is it. Yeah. I've even got poppadoms. You've got poppadoms on the back, Fred, look. Oh look, can't believe that. Can't believe the poppadoms. So this is the weirdest coincidence. Yeah. So this is so weird. It's like I said to Liz, I'm pulling in, my ass is hurting. I need a drink. And she said, so it's a fairly random location. So, this is like, this is so we rode past it and I went, we're going back. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. so for those of you who don't know, <laughs> apart from the splat on the thing, uh, this is Freddy Dobbs, who's a uh, YouTube extraordinaire. <laughs> Hello. And he also runs a business. What's the name of your business called Libertatia. again? Libertatia. Libertatia. And they do some amazing motorcycle stuff. And this is Danny, his Hello, best friend. Right? <laughs> and uh, where are you guys going? Okay, so started South East London slash Ipswich, four days aiming to do west side of the North Coast 500. Oh, where's your base then? You sold it. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> do you have somewhere where you keep some furniture and stuff? Oh, we've, we've got, got a storage. A, yeah, we've got a storage container. A shipping container in Lincolnshire. Yeah. So uh, the bikes, how are they? Oh, we just. I love them both. This is probably one of the yeah. most beautiful yeah. bikes. I know. Ever, ever. It is. Um, Oh, can I get you two? Oh, oh, yeah, of course you can. <laughs> I've got the same one. Oh, I, I had this? exactly the same thing. Danny, do you know what it is? Oh. You tighten it up too much. Too much. And that O-ring splits. It splits and, the, and it comes out of it. Did you get that in sports bike shop? No, I got it from my local dealer. We've got exactly the same. The O-ring will be all right, but the when you tighten it up. So I'm not even over the line either. No, I wasn't. But the pressure builds up inside. And then it forces... Keep so tightening it up, really tighten it up. Keep going. Oh, Keep... and then it pops out. So Jeez. the O-ring splits out of it, and yeah, the petrol yeah. comes out of it. These are... It's spraying these... petrol all over the back. <laughs> what, just... Yeah. Just, yeah. Yeah. just yeah. noticed yeah. it. It happens... It's springing out. The same thing happened to me. Exactly the same thing. Whoa. Right, so I've loosened it off. It's still Sorry, that's sealed. A, that yeah. is a bad design font. It is a bad design font. That's some proper shit. <laughs> we'll all report it. I'll, I'm going to report yeah, yeah, yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It was so literally it was coming out of here like a spring. Yeah. Everything's going to stink yeah. petrol now. Right. Right. Do you know what? That, <laughs> that's that's my favourite bike, I think, there. It's, how my nice favourite is that? Harley. How nice is that? It's a, it's a Road King, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like the old. Uh... They've got the same tent. It's, it's great, this thing, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. It's got it's awesome, isn't it? It's Did you get big. it out of Go Outdoors? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's got the... There's there's the triumph. I mean, we've seen this. I'm gonna say, it's what, been to what, hell and back, Freddy. Uh, I <laughs> yeah, I never thought I'd be riding this again. Up until oh, about man. Oh. It's really nice. You know, it rides like a brand new bike. It's and every time I test out a new bike, I always think, look, they're really good, but this just does everything I need. I really appreciate it because I need something like that, so I might be in the market. Right. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, Lovely. goodbye again. So so nice. Safe, so nice. safe Thank riding, you. guys. Yeah, safe yeah, riding. Safe. Take good care. Really good to catch up. <laughs> Come on, let's go and get a drink. Hello. <laughs> So, would you believe, yeah, how incredible was that? Well, that was quite weird, wasn't it? It's like, um, been 
chatting with Freddie on social media for about what, five years. So yeah. long I've had my license. Yeah. And uh, just decided to pull in here, didn't we, for a quick stop because you've got a numb bum. And uh, yeah. So we're at... see two guys walking out and didn't even see Freddie's face though. He's had his head down. <laughs> so you're famous, Freddie. Incognito, he was. He was trying to hide. I think. Yeah, he's like, oh no, it's that Lizzie. <laughs> but um, yeah, so we've headed back from Northumberland through Yorkshire. And Freddie and Danny, uh, now a lovely guy, was headed... Fantastic Harley Davidson bike, by the way. Absolutely lovely, isn't it? Yeah, his, uh, his road king is beautiful. Very jealous of, not jealous, envious of that. Although he did say a lot of people knock him for that bike because it's a Harley. But what is it with the Harley haters? Don't get it. Oh, it's a lovely bike. It really is. Anyway, look, this is the place where the us famous people meet... This is Bar Barney's. Like What's Barney's. it called? Barney's Barney's Diner. Barney's Diner. So if you want to come and meet some famous YouTubers, <laughs> definitely Barney's <laughs> Diner is a secret destination that not many people know about. Anyway, we've got to go home, haven't we? Wherever that is. Oh, that's another hotel. <laughs> oh, we're going back to our lockup, aren't we? To the Always keep some spare food on the back of your bike, just in case. One. Yeah, none crushed. Just one crush there. I'm but not impressed. I'm not impressed that I hope that will still go with my chutney. Yes, yeah, in your one, isn't it? This is for you, okay? So we bought one of these fuel con these. we bought two of these fuel containers. Now sorry it's a little bit windy, but we noticed that when you tighten up the screw top here if you tighten it if you tighten it too much it pushes the o-ring seal out from between the screw top and the metal canister and the petrol leaks actually when we was here Danny who was with uh, Freddie Dobbs he's got exactly the same fuel canister and lo and behold we looked over and his fuel canister was pissing out petrol just over here I think I've got it on video and it was exactly the same one and what he'd done as well is tightened it right up and that black o-ring there yeah this rubber o-ring had pushed down and the petrol petrol had leaked out of it so you've got a design fault there guys so you need to have a look at that as soon as possible because uh, God knows what could happen if petrol spills out all over somebody's bike while they're riding along final thoughts Lizzie What's your final thoughts? Um, let's hit the road and um, we'll see you soon. Yep, let's get going. Liz. We're just putting the bikes away, aren't we? Yeah, this is where our bikes live. The bikes are tucked away safely until we can come back and take them out again. Over to our little lock up now so that we can put all the camping gear and that we had away because for a few days we're in the car. Got to go back to Essex. Fun times. On our way to redemption I forgot to make 